This year at Westside, we're gonna do Advent a little differently. We're not doing the candles representing faith and, or sorry, hope and peace and love and joy, uh, but we are gonna keep the essence of Advent. You see, Advent actually means arrival. And it's about this season of preparing for the arrival of Jesus, the birth of God the Son, Emmanuel. So what's gonna happen is every day from Tuesday to uh, Monday to Christmas Day, you're gonna get a devotional from myself or Pastor Elias or Pastor Dean. We ask you to watch these videos, reflect on what's being said, and then spend some time on your own meditating and preparing your heart in this season of Advent for the birth of Christ. So that's what we're gonna do together as a church and without any more waiting, here is today's Devo. I wanna start with this. When I was 19, I got my first car. I got it after my first year of college and I was super stoked because that car meant I could live off campus. It means I didn't have to go walk to Kmart anymore to get water. It meant I could be free. If you took that car that same exact car that meant the world to me at 19 and you gave it to me when I was nine years old, I don't think I would have cared very much. In fact, if you went to nine-year-old Joe and you offered him a Lego set or car, he'd go with the Lego set. The difference between the nine-year-old and the 19-year-old is not the value of the car. It's how ready that person is for that gift. So the greatest of all gifts we know is Jesus but unfortunately, because we're not prepared for that gift a lot, on Christmas Eve we get this, in, or on Christmas Day we get this incredible gift, and and we're about as excited about it as a nine-year-old would be over getting a a great gift like a car. We're just our hearts aren't ready for it. So here's how you can spend some time meditating and longing and practicing in your heart this cultivation for Jesus. Go to Isaiah 11, 1. There it says, a shoot will come up from the stump of Jesse. From his roots, a branch will bear fruit. Just think about that picture, a stump. There used to be this great tree there, the nation of Israel, but now it's been cut down. There's nothing there but this stump. And from that lifeless stump, the shoot of Jesse, Jesus Christ, that singular branch, which will bear fruit. Just picture that today. Use that to cultivate a sense of how much Israel lost and how all their hope was in that shoot that would one day come in Jesus Christ. God bless.